Pete's sake! That's no way to wash down a boat. There's got to be a better way. Sometime around the middle of last season, I decided that I was sick and tired of using five-gallon buckets of water to slosh down the deck to remove fish blood and uh, bait scales and weeds and sand and all the other kind of nasty, unwanted stuff that accumulates on the boat during the course of a day. And the way I was going to do this was install a washdown system, but not just any washdown system. I didn't want some wimpy. So I decided to go with the uh, Jabsco Parmax Ultra. It's a new pump by Jabsco. It comes as a kit. It's got 80 PSI, 7 gallons per minute. It's a very powerful pump, and it's a bit more than what I need for a boat of my size. It also weighs quite a bit. You can see that it's pretty hefty, so I had to make sure that I had enough room on uh, my boat for it. Luckily, I did. Uh, I found room in this compartment right here that also, that also ho uh, holds my uh, oil tank for my outboard. There was enough room to squeeze it in the back there, so I was good to go, relieved to find that out. Anyhow, this is a great little pump, or a great big pump, I should say. It draws uh, about 28 amps, so you also have to make sure you have enough battery power for uh, a pump of this size. The pump, I think I mentioned the pump comes as a kit. Jabsco manufactures it with these easy disconnect uh, port system. Uh, they also provide a pump guard intake strainer. just snaps in like that. You snap that little fitting down, and you're good to go. Same with the other, uh, the other fittings that they provide uh, as part of the kit. Snap it on, and there it is. Very convenient. Also, as part of the kit, Jabsco throws in uh, you know, different elbow fittings, uh, straight fittings. Uh, also, the electrical connectors you're going to need. As well as a handy-dandy nozzle. So they even throw that in there for you, too. So there you have it, the uh, Jabsco Parmax Ultra Washdown Pump. Let's see if I can uh, install this thing without messing up my boat too badly. One of the first challenges when installing the washdown system was making, making sure I had an uh, adequate water supply for it. Now my boat already comes with two through-hole fittings, but both of them supply my bait wells. I have a, a forward bait well and an aft bait well. I didn't want to drill any more holes in my transom for a, a third through-hole fitting. So I decided to go with a dual port live well, like this Rule Tournament Series 500 GPH model. Has Again, it's a dual port uh, 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 pump, so the top fitting will uh, go through the pump and feeds my forward live well. The bottom port will provide the water uh, for my uh, washdown system. Pretty simple. And this... Uh, this attaches directly to the seacock on my through-hole fitting. Bilge, where we've got the uh, the live well pump, the dual port live well pump that feeds both my live well and the washdown system. You can see that the uh, the lower port on the uh, the pump, the hose coming off the lower port, that goes into the uh, the washdown system. The upper port. And the hose into the upper port goes to my forward live well. That way you can have both systems off of a single pump. Just don't run the two at the same time. I installed the, uh, the washdown pump right here in this aft compartment that also hose, houses my uh, oil reservoir. You can see it uh, takes up quite a bit of space, but it fits in here nice and snug. Just got, just got it to fit. There is the intake uh, hose goes through the pump and comes out through this tube hose right here and I've got it got it attached to a hose coil you can see that and to the provided uh, nozzle head pretty slick when it came time to wiring the uh, washdown system, I made sure to use marine grade uh, tin copper wire. Why marine grade? Well, because it better resists corrosion, it resists uh, gas and oil, resists uh, exposure to sunlight. Not that uh, the wire on my boat is likely to see a whole lot of sunlight, but it's, uh, it's, it's just better all around to use a marine grade type wire like this stuff uh, made by Anchor. I also used a duplex wire, which made it real easy because I didn't have to run two separate wires. It's a nice, 
can see it's a nice, neat uh, package. Both uh, both the negative and the positive wires are uh, encased in one one uh, sheathing, so it makes it very simple to run the wire with, in one fell swoop. And I like simple, believe me. The brand new uh, washdown system installed. Let's try it out. See how she works. Oh my! Look at this messy deck. Whoa! The dirt and slime is blasted away. Much more civilized.